anything right now is because I never wanted to sing to him because I saw that it was not even helping the old song. The song has not been banned. Oliver Twist is a simple um, song that means what I believe that every one of us, whether man, woman, animal, what we all are and we stand for and I have seen. And in the beginning of the song I said, I have a confession, don't take it personal. I don't know where the propaganda started from, but recently on um, social media it's been chaotic. So maybe just you know propaganda. Either they say no more of somebody dying, or they say no more of something happening. So I saw it I was in London, then off to Miami, and then I saw that they banned the song and I called my people back home, my management, and they called uh, NBC, NBC or which one is it? NBC and they said they are not aware of it being banned. And I've been my people say they've been hearing it everywhere. Radio stations are still playing it. Do you know how many views we have? <laughs> ah, it's only CNN that wants to put it now. It's just a wait. <laughs> so it's not been banned to the best of my knowledge. You know, and um, and um, if there's anything that they want to ban it for, we'll see it. We will always correct it. They've banned a lot of my songs before. It's not the first song that I've banned. Understand? But this has not been banned. Not yet, at least. Okay. Uh, I, I saw an interview on uh, Studio 53 in which you talk about. Uh, Having sort of a, an international tour, and I believe the Ghana gig is like a step from Ghana. Which other ones have you lined up, say, in Africa coming up? Um, actually, this is just intro. This tour is going to be major, by God's grace. Um, my new album, even though yet I don't know the date is coming out, because now before, I can tell you before, this song, Why Me, is coming out, Fall in Love is coming out, because we just go to the Nigeria, I just call the Jazzy. So just when are we going to release so it will be released. But right now it's a bigger platform. Um, you know, we have a JV right now with good music, Universal, so it's a bigger platform, it's global. So it might be January, it might be February. But singles have come out from the album, Endowed, Endowed Remix, Scapegoat, Oliver now. We gave this Oliver because of the time so that will work. But I would say that the tour will comprise I don't know if it's when the album comes out fully, but it's a major, major I won't call it the world tour, but I'll call it African tour. I have Coco concerts coming everywhere. Ghana, here. So this is just an intro. And I'm coming back to Ghana when the, maybe the full album, or when the songs that we're doing right now comes out. Then we have definitely Syria. We have Kenya. I know I have South Africa. I forget Nigeria. That's all right. Then we have Uganda. I think in Uganda I've almost been there before. Tanzania. I have Tanzania as well. Um, Liberia, Charlie. Hey, Charlie, Mame. Mame, Charlie. They confuse me. That is, so I have Liberia, I think I have Congo, and um, one other French speaking country. But for the first time, I'll be going to all these places. I've been to some of them before, but now, obviously, the last time I was there was like maybe two years ago. So there's a lot of more content right now. So, yes, we'll be doing it too. If anybody wants to come on board, feel free to come on board. <laughs> Every country I go to, I'm going to do something with somebody there. I love it. Recently, Kanye West surprised you on stage, and uh, he handed over. Uh, something special to you. How was it for you? I mean, yes, you said it was a surprise. What was going through your mind at that time? Um, for like two years, three years now, since I started my career, I asked God, why am I doing this? And God has really been great to me. But the first thing I realized is that I actually represent a continent. You're talking about 800 million. Um, I left Nigeria when they started giving me the foreign years, and then I started saying Ghana is my home, you know, Sierra Leone is my home, and this one is my home. And for me, when that happened on stage, Kanye West, first of all, showing up, Apollo Hammersmith, when I was long in London, doing some, when I used to work in that place on the streets, it's a dream for you as a musician to feel. Apollo Amazon. It is a hall that everybody, in fact, when Drake went to London, that's the same hall. When you cross, everybody there, you want to have something to say that I, I did this. You go there. It's just like they perform in an international congress center here in Accra. I believe that is our like, major. So for us to have feel that, and then for him, it was a, it was a sellout. It was a great show. Kanye King got on stage, gave the music. It's the, the good music chain with the Jesus piece. I felt very humble. I felt like, wow, I represent Africa. So now, there's pressure. There was pressure before. Now there's more pressure. 
this guy put this thing on me now. Ha! What am I going to do next? How are we going to do it? It's just a, it makes you feel like, wow. It makes you, there's one happy feeling, and then there's another feeling that says that. It's like you're just collecting the button. Take. Let's see what you can do. So that's a lot of responsibilities put up on you. So you know, try and manage it. But also, I believe that that was a kind of responsibility that was put on Kanye West himself. Um, 98 or 99, yeah, when, um, what's his name, uh, Demon Dash and Jay-Z, they did the same thing for him at the end of the concert in New York, and I believe since then till now, Kanye West has done this, and so I saw it as, wow, for him to do it, he must have seen something, because it's the first time I've seen that kind of thing happen, and, 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 and uh, after that I went to Miami, <laughs> I went to the last for one week, every morning I wake up, I walk by the beach, no shoot. I said, God, is this me? I pitch myself. I said, somebody said, please pitch me. And I pitch myself. I'm the man. It's me. <laughs> but it's just great. Um,